Hello and welcome. Today we're going to be learning how to convert improper fractions to mixed numbers. So let's say we have 10 over 3 and need to make it into a mixed number. This is an improper fraction because the numerator is greater than the denominator. To make this into a mixed number, we turn this into a division problem. So let's say we have 10 divided by 3. So 3 goes into 10 3 times with a remainder of 1. So our big number at the front will be 3 and then we'll have 1 over 3 because our denominator will always stay the same. So when we turn 10 over 3 into our mixed number, it will be 3 and 1 third. Let's look at another example. So, let's say we have 15 over 7. So, we make this a division problem. 7 goes into 15 two times with a remainder of 1. So we will have 2 and 1, sorry, 7. So when we make 15 over 7 a mixed number, we will get 2 and 1, 7. Let's look at one final example. Just to make sure you know this. This time we'll look at let's look at 29 over 3. You don't always have to do the division problem. Eventually you just get good at looking at it and making it into a mixed number. So this time let's try that. So how many times does 3 go into 29? nine times because three times nine is twenty seven so our number at the front will be nine and then we'll have a remainder of two because twenty seven and if we count to twenty nine we have twenty eight and twenty nine so two and our denominator will stay as three so our mixed number will be nine and two thirds so it's a bit harder to do it without writing it all out, but it's much more efficient. So I encourage you to try to do that. And that's how you convert improper fractions to mixed numbers. I hope this video was helpful. If you liked it, give it a like. And if you want to know how to convert from mixed numbers back to improper fractions, so go the other way, click right here to learn that. And I hope to see you next time.